Requesting a change to an existing feature or a completely new feature in Vectorworks is done on the forums in what's called the wish list. Once you're on the forums, scroll down a bit and under the feedback section, the first item is wish list featuring content requests. Here, you can scroll down and you can even search this to see if there's someone else who has already wished for an item that you'd like to see in Vectorworks. We'll click on a recent one. Here we have an example of a brief but well-written wish. Both the features have been requested and what the reasons for the features are listed here as well. That's incredibly important in a feature request. Not only do we need to know what you want, we need to know how you'd like it implemented and what you want it for. Here we have an example of a poor wish. It doesn't explain what the problem is, it doesn't explain what the change is that the user wants, and it doesn't explain why they want to change it. The more specific you can be, the more likely it is that your wish will get traction and be picked up. In previous versions of the forums, we used to do what was called the plus one system. So that you would go ahead and just do a plus one to show your support for a feature. But now what you should do is up at the top left, there's a voting widget. You can either vote the wish down or up, depending on how important you think it is. And you can, of course, come back here to the wish list feature and content request, go to sort by, and see which items have the most votes. The more votes a particular wish has, the more likely it is that it will be included in Vectorworks.